A new online youth forum has been launched to provide discreet mental health support to youths. The forum, called Let's Talk, is designed to preserve anonymity, providing a safe space where users can get professional advice or peer support. Over 5,000 users have joined the forum, which is part of a mental health platform developed by an office under the Health Ministry, together with the Institute of Mental Health. Sherlyn Sia takes a closer look. Meant to be used anytime, anywhere, like on a mobile phone. If youngsters are seeking mental health advice, they just need to create a post using their online avatar. No names needed. Professional therapists will respond within 24 hours and direct them to further help if needed. There's also a 100-strong peer support network of trained volunteers who may chime in. Such features have led Let's Talk to become the go-to platform for 26-year-old Chung Zhu Yuan, who uses it almost every day. When I have like questions about um, how to organize my thoughts and feelings, uh, I will post on the platform and uh, maybe get some feedback or some validation whether certain things I'm feeling is it okay or is it um, like uh, am I am I going in the right directions and things like that. Um, sometimes also, uh, I would like to go on a platform to see if there's anyone else in need and how I can pay it forward. There are also pages where youths can discuss various topics ranging from student life to adulting or stay up to date with events happening on the ground. Following a soft launch last year, Let's Talk has already reached 80,000 online visitors. Its developers took inspiration from popular community sites and actively engaged youths in the creation process. So every single detail of the platform, from what we are going to call each section, how we are going to section the forum, even the colour scheme and the designs, we talk to young people about it. We'll say, hey, you know, do you think A, B or C is better? Yeah, we really want to do what you guys want and not just what we think is best. Safeguards are also in place to keep out harmful content. Where certain words are, certain, are going to be like flagged up by um, the system and then some posts will be automatically removed altogether. But we also have full-time staff who are on board watching the platform like a hawk yeah, to make sure that any post with triggering words, triggering content uh, is going to be moderated. And instead of shutting these users down, the team personally reaches out to them to find out if there are underlying reasons why they posted such content and offer support where needed.